Merci beaucoup. <rire> Bonsoir à tous et à toutes. Uh, ni hao ni hao. Uh, uh, so I know I'm so bad in English, and uh, even in French actually, but I know ni hao ni hao. Uh, thank you very much for your kind words. I'm glad to be here tonight. Uh, before I start and get into my speech, and they, they told me that they wanted me to be brief. So brief for a politician, and some would say it's still politician. It means about 30 minutes, so you can have another drink if you want. Uh, but let me answer Francis. Francis, such a great speech. Uh, he deserves a wonderful head of applause, and very, very inspiring. And, and, and my best as well to Senator Ho, uh, and before he does it, uh, I will tell you, Francis, uh, you should become Canadian citizen and run with my party, because <laughs> Senator Ho decides to invite you. <laughs> so, so, I'm glad to be here. There's, there's many friends, actually, it's like a, a family uh, meeting. Uh, I see Neil actually with CCCC, uh, a guy who's been doing a lot for the Canada-China relationship. Uh, well done and thanks a lot for what you've been doing for the two countries, but as well for the, uh, for the uh, business relationship that exists and that's growing. Uh, before I proceed as well, I'd like to say uh, hi to Vincent uh, by his team. Uh, fantastic. And Vincent, I'm going to get back to you a bit later on and to uh, tell you the reason why I'm here tonight and I'm so happy to be here. Uh, I would like before I start as well to say thanks uh, to uh, the sponsors. Uh, we talk about André, uh, uh, Pierre Bissonnette is a, is a good friend of mine, he's uh, with Huawei. Uh, uh, we talked as well about Daniel, where's Daniel with uh, Sun Life? He's uh, right there. Sun Life has been in China for quite some time, we, we, we know that very well. And we talked as well about Power Corporation, and Power Corporation have been in China for, for many years actually, probably close to 35 even, even more. So thank you very much in doing what you're doing, in being here today, and investing in, in, in a sponsorship. Uh, and the reason why I'm thanking you is because in doing that, you are investing in the, in the future. Uh, when Paul Demare, back in 1978, decided to uh, get involved into the Canada-China relationship. He was getting involved basically at that time in two, people would say, a wild adventure. And of course, he decided to do that because there was other people like Pierre Trudeau and others as well that did believe in the relationship, did believe that friendship one day would go more than cultural exchange and that friendship one day would be, would be business as well. I'm glad to be here tonight because, of course, Mr. Demery passed away just a few months ago, and he's been involved in a relationship all his life, and Andre Demery's son took over. And during the 35 years or so that Power Corporation and other businesses like Bombardier have been involved in a relationship, I guess that what they had in mind, it's a vibrant relationship. What they had in mind, it's friendship. But they wanted, what they wanted to see as well, they wanted to see people building bridges. They wanted to see people getting involved into business, doing real business, building something. And tonight, if those people like Mr. Demre, like Brian Aroni, like Jean Chrétien, like Andre Demre from Power Corp as well, if they would be here tonight, they would applause basically what you're doing. Because if I'm here tonight, of course, I've been, I've been involved in the relationship, I've been working hard, and I'm here tonight because I see more than hope. I see a vibrant future for Canada and China. And I was excited during the cocktail when I spoke to two university students. And they were talking to me about their project, and I said, what's the project about? And they said, we have a project with the university and it's a green project, it's going to be good for China. That's one of the reasons why we do it. Of course, in the end, we want to make money. But first, it's going to help our friend, the Chinese. And they said, according to the roadmap and the action plan, we need to establish as well a cooperation in Hong Kong. And then what will be the next step, we don't really know, but we're, we're getting there. So what you're doing, uh, Vincent, Vincent and your team, uh, of course, tonight we've been successful with a fantastic cocktail. 
but what you're doing goes, uh, I mean, it's more than that. You're the new generation. You're a new generation that basically will keep doing what Paul Demerai did, what Andre Demerai did, what Brian did as well when he was Prime Minister. We keep building the relationship and make sure that we're going to have a vibrant economy between our two countries and make sure that for generations to come as well, Canada and China will know not only friendship but economic development and both have major contribution to our GDP. And just to answer Francis briefly, and, then, and I will conclude with that, uh, of course I'm here tonight as the, the president of the, the chapter of CCBC with Andre Philippe Chennai. Andre is uh, our permanent guy in the province of Quebec and he does a wonderful job by the way. Andre Philippe has strong support and he carries both flags at the same time, so well done and well done. Um, but I'm going to tell you something, Francis. We signed the FIPA with, uh, with China. Uh, not ratified yet, but I'm sure that Senator Ho is going to be very supportive and make sure that in the coming fall, we will sign that agreement once and for all that will benefit both our business communities. But during the last leadership, I was the only candidate on stage who said openly, and I wrote about that, that I was supporting FTA between Canada and China. I strongly believe that, of course, to get involved in 2TPP, it's good for Canada. To sign a, a, a free trade agreement with South Korea as well, it's good. But always remember China. We've been there for long. We've been together. I mean, going through good times and bad times. I'm going to tell you that today, good times are back. I'm pleased about that. Senator Ho, your government is doing well as well on that side regarding the relationship. So thanks for what you've been doing, Francis. I'm offering you for C um, CCBC my strong support. But above all, thanks to Vincent, thanks to uh, your team, and just keep in mind that it's not only hope. You keep building the future for, for our two nations. Thanks a lot, congratulations. I wish you all a wonderful weekend. Thanks.